Well, here I am. I've got Wee Woody Halfwood Press number two all ready to send to our associate, Warren Rawls. Halfwood Press, England. Warren is going to take up the task of testing this press, and uh, I'm going to give a couple of pointers on printing with the Wee Woody Halfwood Press. It already has a plate in it, as you can see, and uh, right now I have one felt in it and the gripper blanket. So I'm going to dampen a little piece of uh, uh, blotter paper just to make a blind emboss. It's called a blind emboss uh, based on our color playing card block that comes with the Wee Woody Rembrandt Press. I'm going to put a paper towel down and the blotter paper and just give that a little fine mist, not enough to make it soak, but just enough to make it damp. I'll spray it on both sides. Now that's dampening and uh, time for the test. Fold back the two blankets. The plate is not inked. I'm just making an embossing now to test uh, my skill at printing. This is a two-handed job actually. I'm going to turn the press around a little bit so I can get a better grip. You need to uh, help the press bed along and turn the wheel at the same time. Uh, and I, I like to go two times, so now I'm pulling the bed back, and if I want to, I can push this way. Sometimes it goes on its own, sometimes it doesn't. It's just a good idea to plan on using two hands if you need to. And there's my embossing. If this had been inked, of course, uh, all those embossed lines would be colored. I'm tempted to get up my watercolor brush and start watercoloring while this blotter paper is still damp, because that would be make kind of a nice effect. But that shows me that uh, my pressure is right for printing. Uh, there are some time, uh, two, two blankets that come with the press for increased pressure, because you might be able to do intaglio prints with this press uh, if you're skilled enough. So there you have it, how to uh, print with the Wee Woody Rembrandt Press. I'm Bill Ritchie, and thank you for watching.